Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Trip Run Multiverse with your host, the man who went through a weird love of American movies in the eighties <laughs> and nineties and dedicated two sagas to those things that I liked, Carl Charles and And uh the man who lived in the censored version of Hell, the home for infinite losers, C. Y. Chung. And recently, um some bit um a great legend known as Akira Toriyama. Um, sadly passed away, and as you all know, or some might not know, he's the creator of Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, Dragon Quest, and some other stuff that I... Dr. Slump. Dr. Slump. Oh, Ariali. There we go, yep. And basically shaped a lot of people's childhoods, and mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. Uh, the mass great following, yeah, um, sadly died at the age of 68. So we thought, hey... He had a huge impact on both our lives, is 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 is. So mm-hmm. we thought, hey, we'll do a little tribute and talk about our favorite Dragon Balls moments and other people's dragon favorite Dragon Ball moments and kind of discuss it and then give our opinion. So mm-hmm. I found a couple of lists. I'm just gonna go through them and discuss some of them. So this list I found on Quotebook Resources. C and mm-hmm. the article is called 10 iconic dragon ball scenes that everyone will remember let's see if we remember them well to be fair as well if this ain't dragon ball oh it's like i think i mean this the whole circumference yeah. yeah and i don't know how much you watched of original dragon ball <laughs> oh i don't think much is in this because i've kind of seen okay. this but <laughs> <laughs> i think only like one maybe from that like, dragon ball okay yeah. so at number 10 they have Goku and Raditz are killed by the special beam cannon, Dragon mm-hmm. Ball Z. So, for those who don't remember this, um, this is very early in Dragon Ball Z, and um, Goku's brother Raditz comes and says, "Hey, you need to become a se- you'd be like a ruthless saying like us. Or if not, I'm going to kill your family." So he steals Gohan. Yeah, kicks the crap out of Goku, and. Yep. and him and Piccolo, who at this time Piccolo is Goku's mortal enemy. Yes, yes. Um, from from Dragon original Dragon Ball, yeah, which which the Z saga does it re- even recap? I don't know. Slug. I don't know. At the beginning of Kai, they do recap it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they go to a place, some deserted island. No, I don't even deserted island. Some just forest. Honestly, forest. There's not even a forest. It's just some Greenland. Yeah, just somewhere out in the middle of nowhere. <clears throat> yeah, and they fight Raditz, who is like ten. I wouldn't say ten times stronger, but he's a lot stronger than them. Well, wait. If if you add up their uh, um, what's it called? What? The power scores. Levels. What? Yeah, yeah, power levels. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, and Raditz, I think, is meant to be twelve twelve hundred at that point. One thousand two hundred. And then you got Goku and Piccolo, which about four hundred each. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. And but but the the way that it, his difference is it uh, Radis is at a static level, whereas Goku and Piccolo can increase theirs with their key attacks. Yeah. So when he charges Kamehameha or Special Beam Cannon, all of a sudden you know the power levels go up. Yeah, for that moment. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So they have a fight, and then Piccolo's like, "Hey, I've been practicing." This move that I made so I can kill you. But yes. as we're kind of allies at this moment, I'm going to use it to possibly kill your brother. Yeah. So Goku's like, okay, cool. I yeah. will fight him while you're charging this up. So they fight. Goku yeah. finally like charges it up. And Goku. Well, goes, he, he does it the first time. And I think he, it, Raditz is like, nah, I'll just take this point blank. And then when it starts coming towards him, he's like, actually, I think I'll move. Yeah. So then Goku puts him in the form of Nelson and sacrifices himself to take the special beam cannon while holding Raditz and he goes through mm-hmm. both their chest. This is his. And yeah. this is where Goku dies. For the yeah, J- Goku goes to uh, the next dimension. Yeah. And yeah. Um, <coughs> I... To be fair, I, I do remember this moment, but I wouldn't put it in my like top moments because 
It's kind of like a uh, footnote. Like, I will say this. I, I will say this. Depending on what the rest of the list is, of course. But yeah. this is more like a of a of one of those catalyst moments that starts other things going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so it is an important moment. Yeah. Greatest moment? I don't know. Yeah. No. no but no, no, no. if you're judging it on how it affects the story being told afterwards, uh, uh, and and uh, how how it, how good it is at the particular time, uh, like you know, for the characters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll say that. But yeah, because Piccolo finally gets his win <laughs> over Goku, right? Yeah, killing him, but not killing him, and then making his own heel face turn because it's uh, you got other worse people coming. Yeah, super. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. And then without that, then Goku, uh, Gohan wouldn't be uh strong enough to fight whoever it is later on. Yeah. Yeah, and then always slacking, right? But. Yeah. And then and then repowering himself up and then slacking again because that's how that's how he rolls. Yeah, that's how he rolls. Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But, yeah. Yeah, it was like yeah, it, it it was a good way to sort of start off the seriousness of like Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also I also think this moment for Piccolo. What what's the what the actual moment is when they team up or when Piccolo kills him? And Piccolo. And, and Piccolo kills him. Yeah. All right. Because yeah. that that's got built from Dragon Ball in it, where P- this is Piccolo Junior and uh, Piccolo Senior got killed by Goku. So there's a whole other backstory. Yeah. <laughs> involved in that. Kind of ties up loose ends, kind of. Yeah. So if you if you're just coming in it as it is. Yeah. Like even just just from the break when Z started, you're like, okay. Like sure, All right. yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, no, it's not that. It's just like the the the, the, the build is not there. No, you know, there's no build. No. <clears throat> you you kind of need the at least knowledge of the other stuff to get to the point where you're like, oh, okay, he got rid of revenge, but he didn't really get his revenge because now, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. For someone like me who started with Dragon Ball Z, it was like, okay, this doesn't this isn't really impactful or anything. But not to yeah, yeah. go later on, like oh, and go back and realize, like, oh yeah, no, it's quite. Huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It. Okay, so their number nine moment is Goku achieving Ultra Instinct for the first time, Dragon Ball Super. Okay, oh no, now, now uh, for some reason, I yeah. thought you were going to say Super Saiyan, but then I was like, that's probably moment number one. Yeah, probably. I'm, yeah. I'm predicting, right? Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Um, as we go through this, you know what, we'll probably just clock it in our heads. Oh, what what might be further up the ranks? So we might just come across, come across some for you as yeah, you name yeah. and see if we get correct. But yeah. Goku achieving Ultra Instinct, that's what, like, after um, he tried to spirit bomb Jiren, and Jiren's like, nah, bro. He's like, huh, you're mere mortals. This does not affect me. Yeah. 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 And then he, he kind of just throws it back at Goku, and yeah. yeah. I, I don't, you know, personally, I'm like, but, um, I'm not 100% on that, like, yeah. that to be number nine. I might rank myself. Mm. Go, uh, Vegeta achieving um, uh, Super Saiyan Royal Blue. Or no, Super Saiyan Evolution above that? Yeah, Blue Evolution is on that, yeah. Yeah, because, only because, like, Goku always gets them power-ups and then v- Vegeta's got to be, like, the step behind. But when, when you so you knew kind of something was going to happen with Goku there, right? Yeah. But you didn't know... If Vegeta was going to get a power up and um, you know show uh, Jiren how it was done, which he was doing pretty well. Yeah, he's doing pretty well. He's doing pretty well. But he... but then they always had to have Goku still be above because that thing at that point, Goku had Super Saiyan Blue and Kaioken together. Yeah, yeah. And Vegeta still had just had Super Saiyan Blue, so it was about time for him to have a power. But Goku already went Ultra Instinct before Vegeta even did that, so it's just like okay. Yeah. <laughs> you know? But I, like, it wasn't a. Me- wow, is it a memorable moment? Because I'm trying to remember it myself. So no, no, I don't, I don't, I don't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Pre- it, it probably was a significant moment because yeah. then that's he put him on, on uh, even footing with Durin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, but I think for the entire tournament of power, the anime version, anyways, right? Yeah. Goku was always getting the glory. <laughs> yeah. He 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 he'd get the power ups. He you know it wasn't it wasn't a surprise for me. In no, you know like... it's just like. Jiren, Goku, Jiren's there. Goku will reach relative to him. Everyone else was, yeah. And then Vegeta might get a power up. Yeah. And and maybe Go Gohan maybe, but he he didn't. So. And there's other bits that he does as a 
as Ultra Instinct, I found I find more rememberable when then go on, go on. turn into it. Now we'll, we'll get on to it a bit later because it's oh, right, right. in the next one, the next ones. So, yeah, uh, yeah, I wouldn't class. I it. have to say the Ultra Instinct uh, mu- uh, theme song though. Yeah, that's dope. Ultimate Battle, that's great. Yeah, that's dope. That's dope. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I can't think much of it, so I guess we'll move on to the next. Uh, it, it, I think it's only because it's dulled because Goku's done this, he's done the Kaioken power up, he's done the Super Saiyan power up, he's done the Super, uh, Super Saiyan God power up. He's super, it's super Saiyan, well, he didn't do Super Saiyan 2 on screen, but he did that. Super Saiyan 3, yeah, um, Ultra Instinct, Super Saiyan Blue, you know, all that stuff. Uh, Super Saiyan Kaioken, so kind of like. Yeah, it, it just I actually probably rank Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken above that as well because at that point a t- a hit could uh, use his time stop powers mm. and he's just just incrementally increasing them and Goku was like, nah, uh, power up double like with the Kaioken, I'm beyond your time skip, so it's actually moving faster than time itself. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know. Uh, you're probably going to meet Barry Allen in the Speed Force at some point, but um, yeah. So I'm going to say something. It's not controversial, but it's just how I feel. I've never sort of been a fan of Kairi Ken. I just thought it was kind of like, oh. Okay. It, it got irrelevant after the Super Saiyan power, which was like 50. Kairi Ken could do, what, times 10? Well, think... And then tear apart your body? Tw- times 20, right? Yeah, that's when it started. I was like, this is, <coughs> oh, this is lost yeah. all, like, monster to me. Oh, okay. Just... Time, uh... blah, blah, blah. Time, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so it's two Kaioken times one. No, no, because that's the normal Kaioken, right? Yeah. Then what's Kaioken times two? Because yeah, got... times one shouldn't, shouldn't times one double you, you already. Mm-hmm. That's what, okay, this is... Um, that's what I thought but, was like a weird uh, translation thing, but no, it wasn't. It was just... Yeah. Uh, I, I just always thought, pick because of the, the uh, dynamic regeneration, mm. he should, they should, they should boost Piccolo's power level with the Kaioken, but he got different, he got a, you know, Piccolo orange and Piccolo... Yeah. Unlocks, so okay, fine. And um, uh, and it's always funny. Goku never taught anyone else Kaioken. What a selfish so and so, right? Well, he, well he technically, he shouldn't really, because it's King Kai who taught him it. Oh yeah. yeah wow. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Him. Okay. Fair yeah. enough. Okay, and <clears throat> at number eight on CBR, they have Goku's instant transmission Kamami Ha Dragon Ball Z against Cell. Okay. okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I do actually remember think about this moment a lot because it was quite awesome. Like how, like I don't know. I've been watching recently, like <clears throat> the on Crunchyroll, they got the English dub of Dragon Ball Z. Yeah. yeah. Which which version? Oh, this is where it gets weird. Okay, so it's got the um Funimation voices. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. But it has the Japanese backing track. Okay. Okay. But then it also cuts out like specific things for characters. Like, for example, when oh. I watched yeah. Gohan go Super Saiyan 2, mm-hmm. you know, he's got that song. Oh, yeah. Duh, 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 duh. They cut that out. So, Soul versus Soul, the English version, anyways, yeah. right? Oh, duh, 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 duh. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. They cut <laughs> it out. And I was like, right. and then. Well, they, they, they... Okay, no, no, go on first, and I'll ask you the question afterwards. And then, so it kind of like took away the awesomeness of that scene for me. I was like, oh, okay. At least, oh. like the American one had a sort of Gohan theme when he turned Super Saiyan and stuff. I was like, oh, yeah, that's cool. The Funimation one had it. But it yeah. didn't have anything. So, like, oh, this is kind of dead. Oh. This is such well, okay. a myself. Oh. So, so, didn't they? Because I would have thought they would have played the English language version of Soul vs. Soul. No. And if they weren't going to do that, I'll just play the Japanese version. And if they even not even do that, just play the instrumental version. Yeah, didn't do any of that. It was just <laughs> all right. So okay, there are like, three oh, options. They're like, nah, neither. Nah, neither. All right. So I was like, oh, this is kind of dead. So it could literally, I was all hyped, like, yeah, this is going to happen. Yeah. And no, it just was. Mm. Okay. Yeah, okay. but um, back to Goku um doing the instant transmission comedy hard during the Soul Games. Um, that whole fight was pretty awesome. Yeah. Until Goku decides, hey, I don't want to fight you no more. Hey, Cell, fight my son who has no idea what's going on. Yeah. Not only that, he's like, what, seven at the time? No, nah, he's about, he's, he's 11. Hang on. Is... 
Okay, yeah. No, is he? Yeah. Okay, okay, so three, he was four at the beginning of Z. Yep. Five then... during the, um, five or six during Freezer. Yeah, yeah. And, and then, then three years for the Android cycle, right? Yeah. Yeah, that'd make him eight. And then, he, but you, oh, wait, we forget the time he spent in the the room of uh, Spirit and Time, yeah. the hyperbolic time chamber. So that up to his age, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to say, I don't think it was 11. Actually, wait, I swear there's a year between... Um, oh yeah, they wait. Sorry, no, you're right. They wait three years for Goku to come back from the Freezer saga, and then there's a year they're training for the Android saga. Yeah, yeah. No, I'll wait around. I'll wait around. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. So yeah, it's like, oh, you're just gonna throw this upon your child. Yeah, that's cool. All right. You could at least mm-hmm. give him a heads up rather than like, oh yeah. By the way. Yeah. Gohan, you're gonna fight this dude. Oh. Yeah, and and not only that, that Gohan, I'm just gonna give him a uh, sensu bean to yeah, power him up power to him like. Up. Uh, 100 percent so and, yeah and also he's got that same gene where when we nearly die sort of thing and come back we have even more power so that's gonna yeah the um i forgot it i forgot what it's called um yeah send something something stupid it's a... <laughs> it'll come back it'll come back to yeah. us but it's like goku you just mm-hmm, mm-hmm. didn't think of that too tough did you mate it's not... yeah he we never does, never does. No. All he thinks about is the fight because how many times does he fight his own kid? Jeez. Yeah, yeah he's great guy he is, great guy. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um Yeah, what did you think of this moment? Was, was what, do you often think about it? Is it um like they claim? I I I can't out of hand, I can't remember it off the top of my head. <laughs> Strangely enough. I do I what I do remember though. Yeah. So so it's the um instant transmission Kai, uh, Kamehameha Maha, right? Yeah. And I do remember when he did on Gohan in Dragon Ball Super. Where yes. they were in a beam strike. Because Goku fights his own kids. You know how it is, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, and he fights Gohan, Ultimate Gohan, mm. while he's Super Saiyan Blue. And I think they do um, uh, the Kamehameha Mahas and then Goku teleports behind him and blasts them. Yeah. I'm like, all right. But so good to see that he reused the same tactic. <laughs> Is that the one, by the way, where... He, he, do you think about it? Is it because he blasted Cell, right? And Cell said, I've got the the nodule in my brain, right? That if you destroy, then it destroys my entire body. And that's the Kamehameha heart that blows him in half. Yes, that is. With it, his yes. top half disappearing, right? Yeah, and, and then his legs and like crotch. Yeah. yeah. And then somehow he still manages to regrow. Yeah. So you, you did you think about it for the for how awesome it, that moment was, or do you think about it like that makes no sense after because Toriyama wrote afterwards that, that, that yeah. No, I just thought it just looked it just looked awesome. Like oh cool, he was there now there and then blew off the dude's chest. That's quite dope. Yeah, that's why I thought it was awesome. <laughs> so you forgot about the chip of the brain thing. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Um, I, I yeah. If I had a comparable moment, though, I don't know if I'm gonna be. Spoiling something up uh, else a bit further up there, hmm. but when Vegeta blows himself up, Ooh. that is more something I do. I do. I, I. I. As a more awesome moment than this moment, comparable. Yeah, yeah. That's directly. why. That, if 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 that is on the list, that's why that's probably like lower. Yeah. But uh, that, that's also be- uh, you mean higher because it's going to number one, right? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, but that's because Vegeta is like. He has that speech afterwards, and he he talk to he lets he he tells. About Bulma and Trunks and stuff. There's build towards it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, yeah but sorry, yeah, yeah. No, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm only saying moments that are just going to spoil the list. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but yeah, that was cool. So I'll move on to number seven. Seven, seven. Goku's ultimate... Sorry. Goku's Ultra Instinct Kamehameha against Khalifa. Dragon Ball Super. Okay, okay you know... Go on, go no, on. You, no, go you go first. Go, you go, you go, you go. Uh, I, that was like, I, I don't... Okay. Now, oh, uh, uh, Kale and Khalifa. Yeah. The, the fusion, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. I don't know uh, myself um, how awesome I'd say it was at that point because in the tournament part, like I was just saying earlier, he fights everybody. Yeah. In the, and, uh, in the manga version, Gohan does it, which I'm like, yeah, okay. You know, oh, is it? Uh, yeah, yeah, he gets to do that. Oh. He fights. He fights the fusion. And he's stronger so, than him. 
Well, I think he's comparable. Oh, uh, okay. All right. All right. But you remember, you got to remember, they only found about um, Super Saiyan like two days before the tournament, roughly. True, I'm just true, joking. True, true. Yeah, but you're, you're right. And, and, <laughs> and, then they, and then they found about a fusion like a day before, hours before. So, you know. Hmm. Uh, I'm not surprised that, that Ultimate Go- Gohan would be able to take them. But, and yeah. we wouldn't we, we don't know about the power levels by the way at um at that point anyways. Like uh Khalifa and uh Kale. I would just assume they were strong because of um the Brody one. What's her name? Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Kale, yeah. yeah <laughs> she she had an awesome moment in that where she's in the tournament with power where she was just Broding everybody about like Doomsday, right? Yeah, yeah. And they just walk through a uh, super same blue Kamehameha heart, which yeah. people are like, oh no, he held his power back because that's not possible. But then, uh, yeah, okay. Then put him in blue, then to do that. Just put him in normal super same or something, and then she can walk through it. Uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> but yes. <laughs> um, but but yeah. that, that's the point as well, by the way. Mm. That's when Cyborg uh, Android 17 can fight super same blue Go- uh, Goku. So uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah it's all right. Well, um, I yeah, I would class this as one of my unforgettable moments. Would it be in the top ten? Possibly, because the whole animated scene is pretty awesome. How he yeah, sort of like runs up their energy beam with his. Oh yeah, yeah, that that was cool. That was yeah. cool. I have to say. So, um, whether you can say like you can run across an energy beam without sinking in, like is an energy beam water? What is it? You know. I don't know. Yeah. It did. It did look nice because then I remember him actually, <coughs> kind of doing a handstand with his own ball of energy yeah. skating across of it. Yep. So it was a slick moment. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh, this is dope. Oh, okay. Yay! And then that's how they get eliminated. Yeah. yeah. I, but I think I think I think in the like, if you're saying, is it is it an epic moment because of the build towards it and all the other factors, or as a singular vacuum itself? That's 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 what the awkward things are. I would say the single vacuum is to me. Yeah, yeah it looks yeah. cool. It's a, it's, it, yeah, like, yeah. it looks an awesome scene, right? Yeah. Um, yeah. You just like, sometimes I think sometimes other things go a bit higher because of they've got they look good and they're built towards it as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they stack a bit higher on certain other ones. Yeah. Though I will say some things that just look cooler and be you'd be like, yeah, okay, that's that's great. And then yeah, some things right. are like they they're not that cool, but they they got the build and the payoff. So you're like, yeah, mm, yeah, mm. yeah. That works, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. A great moment. And moving on to number six. six. Goku's final attack against King Piccolo. Dragon Ball. Yeah. This yeah. is where um, he's got his arms and legs broken. <laughs> okay. So this is the super, su- the super, tor- the, the super riding uh, torpedo headbutt. Oh, uh, yeah. When he goes through a minute. Yeah. 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 And then. Pick King Piccolo somehow spits out the the big. I want to say seed, but it's not really a seed because it's massive. It's uh, out of his mouth, which, yeah. but it's got a hole in the center of his chest. So yeah. where did that come from? Logic wise, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> but yeah, because again, I've only seen this sort of clip because I haven't watched Dragon Ball fully. Yeah. I've only watched like the last saga where they have the world tour, the last. Was it 25th to Kenji? Whatever it is. Kenji Kubutakai? Yeah. So uh, when Goku comes back as like a six foot tall, 14 year old, whatever it is. And then. <laughs> no, 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 no. So it's the first one. I think it was 21st, 22nd, 23rd. But in the first one, I think he was 12 or 13, right? Because he couldn't count. No, no. He said he was 13. He was actually 12 because he couldn't count. Because yeah. they. Toriyama just then retconned him. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and then he was 15 on the next one. So it's 18 on the. Um, the third one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So yeah, either way, that's when I started seeing it from then. So I but missed it, this bit. Yeah, this bit had build as well because um, I think he uh, got like te- uh, was it Piccolo killed Ten Shin Han as well. Yeah. And at that point, he was old Piccolo, and then he he used Dragon Balls to wish himself immortal, so he became young Piccolo. Okay. And then he was terror, and then he destroyed the Dragon Balls, and oh. uh, yeah, okay. it was terrorizing the the world, uh, you know. So it was terrorizing. Yeah. Sorry. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's stupid. 
Okay. And then he had his kids. Then he had his kids, uh, drum and tambourine and all that other stuff. And then you're like, okay, all right. <laughs> yeah. So what happened to them dudes? Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. They got killed. They got oh. killed by Goku. Which, and he killed Krillin as well. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, but you would have thought, right? If Super Saiyan was around then, at that point, would have Goku become Super Saiyan? Yeah, but you got to remember Tsurami did thing that forehead. So, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious. Uh, okay, yeah. and he hadn't seen I, I will say as well something from, but he's probably not on the list as well. But something I do, I do, I do think there was significant build for, and there was payoff. Um, back in Dragon Ball, not everyone could fly. In fact, Goku could not fly for like a long while. Yeah, that's not until he was in the when he was past eighteen. Because yeah. when he went in that tournament, and then they tried to knock him out the thing, and then he could fly. It was like, oh, you know, find yeah. he find he find a bit, he could do it right. That's but why he uh, had he, Nimbus, isn't it? Yeah yeah. yeah, 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 exactly, exactly. Yeah. Uh, well, he'd use his tail. He'd spin his tail like a helicopter somehow, right? Like tails himself. Okay. Miles Prowler. Yeah. Miles and fly Prowler. with that. Well, no, he wouldn't fly with that. He'd kind of hover and oh, stuff yeah. like that. He'd okay. just use it to not get himself eliminated. Yeah. In the tournament. But I think, it probably is not on the list, but Goku flying, actually, it, there is build to that. A year-long build. And that was a kind of significant moment. Okay. Huh. Again, I... I don't know what should be getting Dragon Ball. I keep meaning to go back. I'm like, should I? Can I be bothered? Uh. <laughs> well, it's it's uh, very, very many episodes. I got I got into the I got to the Red Ribbon Saga, yeah. and then kind of like skipped <laughs> towards the the Tenchu <laughs> with the guy. Like just watched the 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 you know the tournaments, which yeah. then never existed in Dragon Ball Z ever again. <laughs> oh yeah, because well they did until the sort of as a plot device in the. Um... Oh yeah. Sorry, in the, the um... Boo Saga, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Plot device. But yeah, um... So yeah, I need to go... Because oh, I'm a bit of a... Am I complete? Yes, I don't know. I should actually go back. But yeah, we'll see. But yeah, <laughs> I can see why this is a big moment. Because, you know, yeah. again, it leads to future things. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, number five. Five is Goku and Vegeta's beam struggle. Dragon Ball Z. So I think this is the... From what I'm seeing here, it's their first fight when they're in a desert. Yeah. And mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, Vegeta does Gallic Gun, and then Goku does Kamehameha with the Kaiuken times four. Yeah, what, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> and visually, yeah, it looks cool. Because I remember replaying this in one of the many games where they re- redo the sagas. And, yeah. And each time I'm like, oh, yeah, I remember this moment. This is cool. This is pretty when yeah. I was like, I'm all in on Dragon Ball. Yeah. Yeah, I think that entire. I I, I think they're just picking cherry picking a moment, but the entire fight was great. Yeah. Well, that's it. It's a you know in many episodes fight, right? Yeah. Not as not as long as the five minutes on Namek, right? But God. still, yeah. it, it it's they built towards that particular moment. Yeah. And and that Sao plus Vegeta, right? Yeah. <laughs> Even though he won, for some reason, to what gets him uh, agitated for the rest of his extended. However many years later, is, I never, I can't beat him. I can't beat. Him. Shut up! You only had one fight, and you beat him at that point. Yeah, just do, man. Just calm down, man. You know, even if he overpowers you and he's levels higher than you, you can just gloat. You could just think to yourself, "Nah, he ain't beat me. That's yeah. all right." Even yeah. though he beat eighteen, who beat you? Nah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Some of Vegeta's um, quarrels are quite weird and like yeah. super petty. Oh, dude, that's minor. You can go over that by now. But even uh, though Goku beat Frieza, who killed Vegeta, now nah, Vegeta, you got the victory over him. You don't need to be, you know. Yeah. Don't worry about nothing else. It's like, oh. but yeah, I, I think what I watch, like it's weird as well. Um, I don't know if what it is memorable, but I don't know. Like in animation wise, will I go back to watch this? Because I don't. What know, the I, thi- yeah. Like, I find some of the early Dragon Ball episodes animation not hard to watch, but like, you know, it get, as it goes on, it gets better and better. Yeah. Yeah. Like, well, it gets more modern. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I don't know if I. Wait, I'm going to try and watch this, this bit again. See if I still feel the same. Okay. Hmm. Um, But I will, I will say this, right? Yeah. It's, it, it, it's, it's everything else that came towards that. Like yes. how uh, Nappa killed everyone, and then Goku came back as the, the you know the final um, hope final of hope. Of, yeah. of the Z fighters, and then when he broke Nappa's back, and then Vegeta's like, "Oh, that pathetic 
piece of trash. Yeah. I'll throw him in the sky and blow him up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then Goku having to go, just having learned Kaioken times two or whatever, and then can Kaioken saying, don't go too far, you'll mess up your body. Yeah. And then he has to go times four to counter it because he's like, this guy's much more powerful than me. Yeah. And yeah. And then he's like, um, so, so yeah. it was, it was, it, it, it you know, <clears throat> It's a good moment, and and Vegeta got the the bad end of it. And when he got bl- uh, hit with the, when the beam struggle finished, and he's getting blasted upwards, and he's like, he kind of has to ride it out and yeah, and to it, like, kind of turn, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, turns over, all, all like burnt and crusted, and well, not really, but his armor yeah. is like, I, I and then he's like super, I can't believe it. Yeah, I'm like, oh, right, calm down, dude. Yeah. <laughs> that lowly saying, I'm the prince. Yeah, yeah. It, it was one of those things where he's just like. Bro. Calm down, dude. Yeah, like, <laughs> you know, yeah. but he ain't. He ain't. They, anytime you tell someone to calm down, they just power up, right? Yep, especially him. That's just like <laughs> that's how you get him to become like a super saiyan. Like, turn the calm down. <laughs> I better calm down. I am the lord of the saiyans. Blah, 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 blah. Cool. Yeah, yeah, that's a good moment. And at number four, 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 and you kind of mentioned this earlier. It is Vegeta sacrifices himself to stop Boo. Number four, I am okay. You know what? I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of happy where this position yeah. is because it. Um, well, you know, I'm pretty sure Goku going Super Saiyan is number one, right? Yeah. Um, probably Gohan going Super Saiyan two is somewhere in there, Maybe. and 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 then I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, but. All right, yeah, yeah, I, I can see, I can see that. Yeah, um, like, being all right. This is that like come to reality moment for Vegeta. Yeah, which, which makes this makes you kind of think about his character in a different way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. after after all the after being possessed by Margin Buu, and just couldn't he couldn't just he couldn't just accept that he already beat Goku. He needs to beat him again. Yeah, and he caused all this chaos. And yep. it, it 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 then we, that's when we like it, he got humbled, right? Yeah. Uh, and then he accepted it, and actually, that, considering that was the end of um, the Z saga, well, you know, the close of it. Yeah. Um, in Super, he's a much more rounded character, and I would say also, in you know, in in uh, GT, depending on how we're going to count it, right? Yeah. Um, he seemed much more at ease with himself because of it. Yeah. You know, it's just like it was the bane of it on his back, right? And then he just like actually, he got better because he could admit someone was better than him. Yeah, he's like, yeah, you know, and I actually do love, do like people. So it's like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, there you go, you know. Yeah, yeah. Even though, even though I smacked my son across the head, actually, actually, you know what? You know what? He's all right. <laughs> yeah, he's all right. I ain't, I ain't gonna say I love him, but he's yeah. okay. He's, he's all right. right. I'll save that to later on, and I'll say it to him. Yeah, when when the future version comes back, and I only give him a thumbs up when he leaves. Yeah, oh. <laughs> that's so awkward. He does that. <laughs> Oh, this kid's gonna have lots of father issues. Oh, God. Yeah, but I think I think what kind of um, dulled that moment though is then he got he came back. Yeah, like not too long afterwards. Yeah, it's like he died and then okay, fair enough. Yeah, then he him to help finish the the rest of it. Yeah, yeah. But it's just like you didn't even let it sell because the boo saga is still continuing. Yeah, yeah, literally, yeah. <laughs> and this is for you, even for you, Kakarot. And, uh, yes. <laughs> final explosion. Ah! Yeah, and I did like it how um, Piccolo Piccolo called him out because he's using that same move. Yeah. Oh no, no, he asked Piccolo. Yeah. No, because that was in the tournament of power when he used the final explosion the second time, right? Uh, yeah. the, the, for that time. Yeah. But then he, he's talking to Piccolo, and Piccolo, he's like, "Yeah, I'm gonna go and um, try and kill Boo. Um, like, you know what? When I die." Do you yeah. think I'll go, uh, you know, where do you think I'll land? And the Piccolo's like, you, you're going to hell. You've killed <laughs> right? a lot of people. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm like, well, that kind of, but then that makes you think, you know, he knows where he's going and he's still going to sacrifice himself yeah, for it. Yeah. So as harsh as the words of Piccolo, of Piccolo are, because he was the Vegeta before his Vegeta. Yeah. Actually added more to the moment. I kind of like how he sort of knew it anyway, because he, Obviously, he just needs the reassurance. Like, where do you film them go? Well, you've done a lot of bad things, so you know where you're going. Like, yeah, thought as much. <laughs> yeah, he'd be like, oh, uh, yeah, no, maybe maybe he turned a new leaf and, you know, yeah. no, 
No, you helped uh, by by getting yourself um, uh, absorb oh, right absorbing Margin Boo, then powering up Boo himself, and then kid uh, was it Kid Boo just murdering how many percent of the world? Yeah, that's all that's of you often, actually. Oh, was it? Yeah, that's afterwards. He did kill. Oh, I'm talking about um, when. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking about when he destroyed the people in the. Um, you don't understand. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. So dude, hmm. <laughs> you're not going to heaven for that. So he's like, ah, I, I thought much. Yeah. Oh well, let me go and do this for you guys, I guess. Yeah. And then he does. So yeah, but that's one of my favorite moment. That's a, that's a that's a like a high up moment for me as well. Yeah. Right. Yeah, because Matt, the man sheds uh, actual tears. Yeah. Well, not for the first time, but it's just like, you know what? Go out in style, yeah. Yeah, like, oh, bless him. He tried. And then number three. Another, this is a, this is a big moment for me as well. Um, number three is Trunks cuts Freezer into pieces. Oh, I, 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 look, it's a memorable moment, but I wouldn't say I'd rank that one above the Vegeta one. <laughs> I wouldn't either, even though like Trunks is one of my like favorite characters, and I love the Trunks saga because it's only like, yeah. five episodes long. <laughs> 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 but I don't know because again, this is weird. I think about this one a lot. I don't know. Why. Oh yeah, it's it's memorable. Yeah. The thing is though, um, it was more like okay, here's uh here's Vegeta who Goku took ex like he you know destroyed so many people, many so many planets. Killed Vegeta, nearly killed Goku, and uh, we got to get the new kid over. So yeah, <laughs> well, I kind of it's, it's weird looking back now. It's like, like with um, my age knowledge now, it's like wow, yeah. they basically jobbed out Freezer, didn't they? <laughs> they probably <laughs> jobbed him out hard. However, it was a cool moment. Then yeah. not only that, it's like um, what's it? King King Cold's like, oh yeah, yeah. I think it's the sword, isn't it? Because your power level is zero, and then he gets done as well. So yeah. So I was like, oh man, this guy's a badass. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, like, and then I like, Look, you know, in, I think it's Super, or was it, it might be Super or um, Resurrection of F, where they show it from a real world perspective, the whole battle, where it's literally like yeah. five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, that's, I forgot about it. I was like, that's awesome. Rather than seeing it in like episode form, literally, you saw it from Bystander, where it says literally them talking. He slashes him in half, boom, boom, boom. I'm like, oh, okay, that's how it really happened, did it? Not two twenty-minute yeah. episodes of them just talking, <laughs> and then that. But yeah, yeah. No, it was. A, I I enjoyed that. It, look, it's a nice moment. It's a nice moment. But I don't even say it's an an ultimate top ten moment. No, 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 I wouldn't say that either. High in the top ten for me. But yeah, I wouldn't say it's number three. Come on now. Mm. And then I guess. If you, in a grand scale of things, it is quite important because it leads to the future, the future, the Android slash Cell Saga and yeah. Toriyama's love for Terminator because this is basically just um, yeah, yeah. coming <laughs> back from the future. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, l let me also p ask you. Yeah. Now, the androids are made of human elements, yes? Yes. Human, like, they're, they're cyborgs, really, right? Yeah. But the, like we were going to say, the machine parts are the Earth-based machine parts, right? Mm. So how can they take a punch from a a, a, a superhuman times fifty when they go Super Saiyan? Maybe they're also being genetically modified. They're human parts. Oh yeah, okay. I could I could say that. I could. Uh, yeah, well, mm, yeah. But then the human parts are then, then stronger than their their non-human parts, right? Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's a bit like Cyborg Superman, where you're going to say his Kryptonian bits are going to be stronger than his metal parts, right? Yeah. But then, it's then when you're fighting Superman, those metal parts are nothing to him. Yeah. That is way... Unless Dr. Jero found some non-Earth metal. Because I think, because, like, even though this is me, like, kind of retconning it myself, and... Yeah. Uh, because, you know, in um, Dragon Ball Superheroes... Um, yeah. Jero's grandson. Yeah. He said he made something to make his skin tougher than blah, 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 blah. blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe he's... <laughs> that's Maybe that's when Toriyama was like, you know what, yeah? After all these years, damn. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Let me fix this. <laughs> yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. 
But that, again, that's me making that self head cannon. You know what I mean? Yeah. <coughs> but it kind of makes sense. Oh. <laughs> well, yeah. yeah. Uh, but uh, and something random as well from yeah. here at this point, right? Uh, you know they never called Ultimate Gohan Ultimate Gohan. No. And it wasn't even Mystic Gohan. Like I think you know the unofficial names are Mystic Gohan, Ultimate Gohan, and uh, Gohan Potential Unlocked. Yeah. They finally, in one of the more late, uh, latest Dragon Ball chapters, actually called him Ultimate Gohan. Oh, so okay. it's a fit, you know. So, so it's officially, officially, yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. So this is one of those things where, like, way back in the the Dragon Ball Z saga, that was what in the mid nineties. Yes, I think ninety five, ninety six. Wait. Yeah, man. Like thirty years later, he's like, oh, and twenty years later, he's t- uh, no, thirty years later, they're like, oh yeah, you know what? Let's just uh, make something canon. Yeah, let's just give it a name now. Uh, people keep bugging me about it, so I'm well just name it now. Oh, that makes sense now, yeah. Because, yeah, I always knew him as Omen Gohan or Mystic Gohan. Yeah. Because it wasn't... I know this is slightly off topic, but not st- still portraying the Gohan. Wasn't it at first Beast Gohan wasn't actually called Beast Gohan. It just, he had no name, and then the fans started calling him that. So then... He just said, yeah, he's beast transformation, I guess. Mm. Even, even though I don't think it makes sense to call him beast. It's not like he goes feral when it comes No, like that's that. what I'm saying. This doesn't make sense to me. Uh, might have made sense for Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, but then it, because how he wrecked the Cell Juniors, right? But not even then, like, I would say, because this is my weird head cannon, but I think it's going to happen, but it probably won't. Yeah. So they can kind of keep a certain form alive. Like, if they gave the whole. Super Saiyan 4 transformation to Gohan but not call it Super Saiyan 4 whatever then yeah. I can understand if he turned to that and he called him Beast Gohan because he's got the even though even though the most logical person to be called Beast anything is Brody right yeah 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 of course yeah but like that would kind of make sense but the cool silver hair Gohan Beast Gohan like okay yeah 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 yeah. Don't even though even though we're getting right? even though what uh, ultimate uh, Ultra Instinct Go- Goku's like what Silver hair as well. Yeah. Would you say that's white hair, depending? Yeah. I don't... Mm, that's a good point. That's a good point. I don't know. Oh, that's something to think about. Yeah. Oh, um, so you want... You, that's number four, right? Um, no. What moment are we on? We're at number three. Wait, 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 wait. We still talk about trance. Yeah, three, 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 three. All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 He, and speaking of Brody himself... I would probably say Broly's like Broly going Super Saiyan. Oh, okay. That entire fight with Broly. Yeah. At the, in the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie, I think is is a more significant. Well, the thing is, it's not a moment though. It's like the last hour of a two hour of a what? How long is uh, Dragon Ball Z Broly? About two hours. I think it's about two hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, even if I just kind of isolate a moment, but where where he turns Super Saiyan, yeah, that is, and then starts wrecking the show. That that is that's something awesome. I, I yeah. yeah, that's definitely will remember. How, how old is this list, by the way? This list, that's a good point. Um, give me a second. It is two thousand twenty-three. So September. I was going to say, oh, if it was older, yeah, then it's older. I'm like, dude, what's wrong with you? But yeah, no, two, September two thousand twenty-three. So last year. Okay, that's yeah. I'm, okay, okay, yeah, fine. Hmm. Even though, yeah, they, sh- I think they should have put the yeah Dragon Ball Z Brody, but yeah. Yeah, there's lots of things I'm thinking now. This is newer that could have been in this, but all right, sure. Yeah, even if you're gonna say old school Brody, where when he when he super saiyans up, right? Yeah. And Vegeta just like. <clears throat> <laughs> well, even they just, unless they're just counting the series and not the movies. Oh, it's true. Weird. Uh, but oh, but even then, I I want to say, <clears throat> what was awesome in that when in the movie where Brody turned Super Saiyan and Vegeta's like Super Saiyan himself, and then because he 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 can tell how much power he just he just kind of depowers because <laughs> he yeah. realized like, I'm insignificant like, oh, <laughs> or no. whatever it is. He gets so demoralized he just not even get hit and turn back into um um normal Saiyan. No, no. It's just like someone else powers up and he's like, oh man. Like, no, I can't believe it. And just, yeah, just his soul leaves his body, and he's like, I can't, I can't even sustain my power up anymore. No. It's like, nah, it's not worth it. <laughs> my life. So, um, 
So yeah, um, I guess we'll move on to the the, the, the next one, which yeah. is father and son Kamehameha. So just as you were saying, you weren't thinking they were uh, using. Oh no, 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 I was going to say just when you're thinking. They weren't using any movie versions because I was thinking of the second Brody movie where it's yeah. Gohan, Goten, and uh, Goku. Goku's ghost, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Go- well, Goku's ghost, whatever. I won't yeah. be able to put it right. They, that triple can't be how my help, but you mean the one from, uh, against Cell. Yep. Right? Okay. Yeah. The father's Which father. of those two, by the way, is yeah. more awesome to you? Um, I'll still say the Super Saiyan 2 Gohan one against Cell. Okay, okay. It's because he's he's got one hand and he's doing it. One hand and the Goku bit, and then the whole back and forth, back and forth, and then and then uh, Vegeta uh, finally being uh, some sort of help. Yeah, and then Gohan walking forward, pushing a Kamehameha blast. Yeah, man, that was so gangster. Yeah, again, mm. another thing I think about regularly. <laughs> I don't know why. So, the the logic is, <clears throat> see, Piccolo, why don't you just? As you're standing in the in the back over there, just charge a special beam cannon. Oh, that ain't gonna do nothing. What do you mean? <laughs> that moves. Point, that... Yeah, they move, oh, yeah. but then you gotta remember, like the cell juniors are beating them up as well, right? That, yeah. At this point, like Piccolo is like a flea compared to Cell. Like when he That's did some Radis and stuff, right? He was like near. I say Radis is power level, so he can sort of do it. But like him to do it to Cell, but Cell was like, "What is this?" Especially I when, think they're, that... when they're all shooting beams at his back, and yeah. he's like, "Just what you're not doing. This is nothing, you know." Yeah, yeah, and I will say in the anime filler, he did do the special beam cannon, mm. and somehow uh, Cell just kind of took it and was like, "Nah." Yeah. But in non in the manga, that never happened because the special beam cannon, mm. depending on the charge, is meant to be able to go through all sorts. He did break the unbreakable barrier in uh, the uh, Universe 6 uh, tournament yeah, with the special like beam cancer. 15 years later and he's stronger. Yeah, yeah, and he charged him for the entire fight, so, you know. Yeah. So, you know. I think that's... So, yeah, I think if he did it here, like, he'll be like, what are you doing? <laughs> and then he'll just power up and knock him away like he was doing to him and the other Z fighters. Like, we're doing nothing. <laughs> These guys are just losers. Sorry, no, they're not losers, but they they were losers. At this point. Oh, well, they, that, that, that's the problem with the the Z fighters. They they did become losers. Yeah, but then they they kind of all get their own back some way. So well, yeah, I, yeah. I think at some point it, they, they the Saiyans <coughs> got so far away. Yeah. From the humans, there was no catching up, and I will say Piccolo got his power ups to to get to a certain level, and then you know they were beyond him, so. Yeah, but yeah. He, he's kind of come back. And then they all had their yeah. sort of moments in, um, except for Yamcha again, in um, the Tournament of Power. So, yeah. yeah. There was hope for them slightly. All right. Um, yeah. yeah. So, um, so number moment number two, Yon, right? Yeah, no. Two, that, yeah. That was yeah. Two. But yeah, great moment. Um, led to Cell's death and Goku become an abs- absentee father again. So, yeah. You know, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Great things come from it all. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then at number one, one, one is Goku becoming the legendary Super Saiyan from Dragon yeah. Ball Z when he fought so, one named Freezer. I, I will say this is definitely, I, I can see why it'd definitely be a number one moment on yeah. most people's list as well if it wasn't in the, at least in the top three or something, because all that entire thing was building towards that. Yeah. Um, yeah the whole and thing. then Krillin getting murdered as well, and then. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, Vegeta had it coming at that point. Yeah. Um, Freezer had it coming at that point. Yeah, he did. Uh, um, also, yeah. this also showed Toriyama's love for uh, another iconic American movie from the eighties and night eighties. Um, yeah. Alien as Freezer's formed his transformations before his final form. Yeah. The resembled... second form freezer, right? That's the alien, right? Yeah. yeah. They resembled, yeah, aliens. Oh, <laughs> hilarious. Um, my friend. Yep. A white guy, because this is, a, this is, in fact, it's relevant, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he was just, he was, as we know in Hollywood, right? All the white people are the greatest, apparently. Yeah. Um, in, in their movies anyways, right? Yeah. So he's like, oh yeah, yes, look at this, look at this, right? 
when uh, someone foreign, even an alien from another planet, wants to power up to the peak of uh, significant power, you know what they do? They become white because he's white, <laughs> he's blonde, and he's got blue eyes. And I'm yeah, like, right. yeah, <laughs> we're gonna say, we're gonna say back to that, right? Like, oh, I see we're going with this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, quite obviously you're joking, but yeah, it was just yeah, like, yeah, yeah it was actually um, quite funny. I found it. I was like, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. But we all know that the Super Saiyan idea was stolen from Sonic. You know, you know. <laughs> Which is like, and then you're going to tell me the seven Chaos Emeralds are also... Um, um, stolen from Sonic? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah the Dragon Balls. The, yeah, the Dragon Balls that are... Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's stolen from Sonic, even though it predates Sonic by like 10 years. But yeah, you know, whatever. Yeah. Well, yeah. the Super Saiyan one, I can, I can see the argument because they did roughly come around the same time. I will say I I, I reckon pro, uh, that they they took the Super Saiyan form off. Uh, uh, Sonic stole it off the Super Saiyans. Mm, it could have happened. Yeah, like it's one of those things. Like I wouldn't deny if it did. Like, okay. Yeah, I, I think it is. It, I, I personally, I think they did it. Uh, Toriyama did it first, and then they took yeah, it. And they yeah. were like, yeah. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but but you know, look, they took it and they made it their own. So yeah. what can you say? It's just like when um. <laughs> It's just like like when they took uh, Alan, well, when they had Miracle Man, well, oh, sorry, they had Captain Marvel and then they made Marvel Man. In yeah. fact, you can even say when they had Captain Marvel and they uh, and Superman, they were they were, well, I would say they were different enough, but whatever, right? DC yeah. decided otherwise. Yeah, that, that's not hilarious as well. Yeah, <clears throat> but look, I, I didn't mind, I, I, and and you'll say like um, Toriyama took from Aliens. Yes. But even though it was one form, but like he took from the Terminator saga, but he made enough crazy differences. Yeah, so you can't get. Where you're like, <laughs> yeah. And then, and then, and then, essentially, when he even started the Dragon Ball saga. Yeah. Uh, and when he got to Z, and then he decided, you know what, my my boy Goku is actually a uh, USA bro, Kal El. Yeah. Everyone's like, yeah, you know what? Okay, okay. You know. Yeah, kind of. I could kind of um, see it, even though Goku, until this point, was a ripoff of what's his name, um, Monkey King, isn't it? Uh, inspired by, inspired by. There's a difference, right? Yeah, same thing. But yeah, yeah, yeah. so you know, it's 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 just like how um, Will Ospreay is inspired by Assassin's Creed. Yes. And how B Priestley, Blair Devonport, is, was inspired by Melina in Mortal Kombat. So yeah, yeah it happens, you know. Yeah. Or Stolen. To be fair, every idea is in some way stolen. That well, they they think this, this is what the, the thing in the fiction, isn't it? Yeah, that yeah. nothing is an original idea anymore. No. It's just how you execute it that's yeah, different. Yeah, different, yeah. So you know, is what it is, man. You know, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm okay with it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> not for me yet. So yeah. So yeah, um, this was legendary for yeah. Super Saiyan. <laughs> again, yeah, yeah. this is probably everyone's. I say this is in everyone's top three Dragon Ball moments. To be fair, because you know, it like oh wow, this thing Super Saiyan, that's awesome. You know, yeah, this is yeah. the strongest they're ever gonna be. Wink, wink. Nudge, nudge. <laughs> Four trans. I'm surprised. Oh. I'm surprised. Go, uh, go, hand, go, and Super Saiyan two is not on there. Yeah, same. Because you know that was that was epic. You know. Yeah, it was a dude yeah. who didn't want to fight, but he knew he had to fight to save the world. So he, yeah. Know, but they, they probably lumped it in with the the father son Kamehameha as. Yeah. Uh, I mean, they are individual sections. Yeah. And one, if you put one and then put the other, when they're so close proximity, you might be like, oh, let it slide. But you can't. You you know, you shouldn't. This is the thing. Uh, you know, when it's in a world ceremony where people can only be voted for one time, like yeah, I'm talking yeah, about yeah. Oscars or whatever, right? Yeah. But in in China, yeah, in the Hong Kong awards, I think yeah. it's the Hong Kong or China awards, you, the actor can be mo- uh, nominated for different films. Okay, yeah, yeah. So and it's like why why I know it's unfair not it's not unfair to do that if they've given a good performance in both yeah, films. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, it's probably unfair to cap them and say you can't go in one if you go in the other. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. that's kind of un- that's unfair. You know. If you um, can't win one thing, let them win another thing. You know. Well, no, no, so yeah, it's just if if you got you've got two good performances in films that just have to come out the same year. Yeah. Well, I can't you nominate both of them. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 
But if you had like fourth good films and then you got nominated for all of them, then that's different. Then I understand. Yeah, yeah, you go because the, the whole thing is all the nominations on you. Yeah, so and that kind of gives no one else a chance. So yeah, that's a yeah. bit of a, a yeah a joke. But no nah, man, the people be nominated twice. You know, stop hanging. Yeah. But <coughs> this moment, yeah, um, it was great. Um, what I'm I like surprised, like, uh, um, yeah. I thought Brody was going to be on there, but you know, it turns out not. Yeah. Um, yeah. Orange Piccolo, would you say that was a, a something that was cool? Yeah, that was good. Super that was Saiyan cool. Beast? That was oh, cool. Sorry. Gohan Beast? But I think the um, Orange Go Orange Gohan. Orange <laughs> Piccolo thing <laughs> kind of got overshadowed by the Beast Gohan thing. Yeah. Because like, like, oh, cool. And then. Oh, he's got a transformation. Then boom, this super one. I was like, oh, okay, cool. Gohan's got a transformation. Or even even um when um when they were fighting Zamasu, even when they went to yeah uh, yeah, yeah 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 fusion versus fusion. <laughs> yeah. That, I... Or even when Super Saiyan Rose Goku got destroyed by Vegeta. Like yes. when Vegeta, like after Vegeta got beat, and then they went to the, the hyperbolic time chamber to train, and he come back and just whooped uh, Super Saiyan Rose, yeah. Rose, uh, Goku Black. I'm like, yeah, that's something, man. There's something about like when I think back now, this is like a weird side tangent as well. Yeah. Back at the whole Goku Rose stuff, yeah, it was good, but like a lot of it now, I think about it, like it's kind of long winded and just pointless. <laughs> I will say, as far as um, the anime goes, hmm. Super uh, Chunks getting Super Saiyan Ikari at that point, yeah, was was something. Yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah, that was you cool. know, yeah, 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 that was cool. But it just and like... then him being able to take both of them by uh, uh, Zamasu and Goku Black at the same time, I thought, uh, I don't know about that. All right, yeah, well, I mean, power yeah. of love, but um, like I don't know because it just seems like. Like maybe he's the only bad guy technically they couldn't really beat, but it is just like oh we beat him like no but I've got this and ha ha, ha and like yeah yeah it's like, All right, cool. this isn't even my final form yeah and it went on like too many times like oh okay just we, we get yeah. it All right. yeah yeah because only because the uh, freeze had to do it four times so everyone else had to do it more yeah so I was like just get rid of it man just wait for him to die <coughs> and then he technically he didn't really die does it because. Well, he he absorbed. He he. De- he's so sour. He decides to destroy the entire universe rather yeah. than accept the loss. <laughs> yeah. So like, oh, okay. Again, like then, I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. But then I think about more like, okay, I guess. I'm I'm wondering why Goku getting doing Super Saiyan three, or getting Super Saiyan four is also not on this list. But you know, um, there is another list. I'll quickly just fly through it and then yeah. I'll just. All right, so I found this other list. Uh, we're not gonna go through all that one, but um, by Screen Rant, and it's got like the top. 50 well, people. Screen Rant is is not meant to be the most. Uh, yeah, exactly. uh, yeah, yeah. But this is but... Like 2017, so hmm. okay, okay. We'll take this a pinch. Of well, yeah, uh, yeah. Just uh, not exactly the most reliable, or you know, the most source uh, accurate. Actually, no. The screws. Uh, I'll quickly go through this one because it's kind of yeah. kind of lame. So, um, fifth at 15, they've got. Oh, I've got 15. Yeah, okay. so that's what I'm going to just breeze through and I'm going to yeah. do it. And it's from Dragon Ball Z as well. So it's number 15 is, it's over 9,000. Yeah, okay, that's quite funny. Um, well, it's a memorable moment. Yeah. I don't know if it's a great moment, but yeah. it's definitely memorable. No. <laughs> it's a meme moment, but yeah. yeah. And then 14, Gohan knocks back cells. Oh, by the way, sorry. Yes. Do you know that line was originally over 8,000? Yeah, and they botched it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then Gohan... And then, oh. uh, Sorry. So I was going to say, because that makes the multiplication on the Kaioken off-key. Okay. Then I think I think Vegeta was 18,000 or something like that. Yeah. So in the dub, they had two times Goku um, Kaioken times four. Yeah. Because he had to go over. He had to go over Vegeta. But I think in because when he was, he was 8,000 before. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Sorry. Yeah. Because if it was 9,000 in times three, he's equal to him. So yeah. he, he, I needed to get him to four, so he should have been lower. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Uh, so 14, Gohan knocks back Cell's Kamehameha. Don't yeah. remember that. Um, 
13. Free Wait, isn't that, the, isn't that the, the thing with you? The, the, the beam struggle at the end? No. I think Cell does a common harm and he just knocks it away with one hand. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I do remember that, actually. Yeah, see, I don't remember that. Um, this is where he t t t ch powered up to Super Saiyan 2 and, and then uh, tr uh, Cell's like having a laugh because like everyone's getting beat up and then he's like, oh, take this and go ahead and just like, boop. Yeah. 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 Pimp slapped it away. 13. Freezer sliced in two. Well, fl sliced in pieces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By go by his own destructive disc thing. Yeah, okay. Oh, right. I thought you meant by uh, by, by Trunks, but yeah, nah, yeah. Nah. And then 12 is Trunks frees the future when he goes back after the whole cell stuff and murders the androids. Yeah, all right. Um, 11 is Vegeta's final words when he's done on Namek and says, Go. Yeah, that is, that is a. a, a... A memorable moment a memorable for definite moment. because he's like, you know what? Yeah, I've accepted my. Uh, this is way the beginning of him accepting his role. Like he made his turn, but he kind of he's still a tween at that point. And then he's like, you know what? Yeah, I regret my. St I regret what I've been going with my life. Yeah, it is until so, like when they bring him back. Like yeah, later, he, the thing that's the thing is like reverts back. <laughs> he's like, yeah. yeah, yeah, he's like he's like. Let's just say he comes in at level ten of yeah. being a dickhead. Yeah, yeah, and then at this point you're like. Um, he, 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 you know, he's regretting his actions, yeah? <laughs> and then when he comes back, he's still, he, he's, he, he uh, gets turned back to life, and then he, he's still a level eight. So he's just yeah. like, what? He's you know? back, like, eh, this is mad. <laughs> yeah. You're all dicks. Like, oh, okay. That's... Thought you would have learned something from that, but all right, no, sure. sure. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> um, then number 10, go 10. Wait, wait, uh, uh, sorry, just to, before I uh, interrupt you again, did you think that, he, he was pla uh, Toriyama was planning to kill like leave Vegeta for dead uh, at that point nah. or do you think there was going to be more coming there's going to be more coming alright because I can see um, like that that, that moment de like as a death moment and never coming back mm. I, I'm like alright and then um, you know he's letting less and he's, he's fine and whatnot. but you know if he comes back you would think uh, if he was planning to come back you would think okay there's a, there's tweaks in his personality. He can be still the same, but not that yeah. level. Except that he was. He's just like whatever, man. I died. I come back. Whatever. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of saw it as like okay, there's them trying to like show you that there's that part in him. Yeah, yeah. And it's then... true. It's true. It, it did give him that the the glimpse of you know what he is not such a uh, dickhead, but yeah. but. Yeah. And maybe then, maybe he's all right, and then he just shows you he isn't. <laughs> straight off, is like, oh, okay, cool, dick. Um, number ten <coughs> is Goten meets Goku for the first time, which yeah, I that's I like that moment. You know, I was like, yeah, oh, dead beat dad and meets his child. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. From that he that you know he never for seven years didn't you know he never know existed. Shows that he didn't um, check in on his family for that seven years. He's terrible. <laughs> exactly. But then again, this guy disappears every single time he has a kid, right? For yeah, for like a uh, extended amount of time. Yeah. I think he just hates his own kids. Yeah, that's what it is. He's like you like, hold me back, even though they don't want yeah. to give me strength. But anyway, yeah, man, got to train. <laughs> you know, never know when the next threat's gonna happen. Number nine, TN try beam against um, cell form two. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, yeah, know. it gave him something to do, right? Yeah. Even though you knew this is his one moment to shine. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And he shined, he did, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He yeah. got some glory and then he got put back into where where he originally was. Yeah. And then number eight is, what are you gawking at? This is where Goku <laughs> needs to get his power. When a final battle between Kid Buu, Vegeta, and Goku. And yeah. Goku needs to power up to get back to Super Saiyan 3. So Vegeta needs to fight Buu for a bit. Uh, yeah, and... I thought you. Was, I thought this was going to be the moment where you think where Vegeta is wearing his bad man pink shirt. Oh no! And Trink, Trunks is staring at him. Yeah, and Vegeta's like, "What are you looking at? What are you looking at?" Oh. Yeah, because at that point, Trunks had come back and he went to Super Saiyan, and Vegeta's like, "Okay, this kid. I don't know who he is. Yeah, I'm yeah. jealous of him already. I hate him. I hate him. <laughs> I can't see any facial features that remind me of myself in him. Yeah, yeah, none of that. He he's got Super Saiyan before me, and he yeah. looks like he's seventeen. Yeah, it's like, ah, <laughs> these kids can do it. Why can't I? Yeah, yeah. Um, number seven is Kamehameha versus Galicon. Yeah, we're going through that. Um, 
number six is Piccolo dies for Gohan. That's in. The oh yeah, that's that's well. something I'm surprised is not on the previous list. Yeah, same. Because that's quite an impactful moment. Because that shows. Yeah, because because of all the builds beforehand, right? Yeah, and that shows um, Piccolo's straight like heel to um, face turn. Oh yeah. He's, yeah, yeah, and something that down. Goku himself would never do for Gohan, right? Nope. Nope. <laughs> And then... Well, to be fair, I know he's totally pointed himself uh, fell to King Kai's uh, thing magic, right? Yeah. Um, and and took the the blow up there, yeah. But I don't think it's quite the same as as uh, Piccolo straight sacrificing himself because yeah, yeah. because Goku put himself in that position because he never should have given Cell the um, sense he been to begin with. Yeah, he he created all this downfall. And then number five, Vegeta's final flash to sell when, again, yeah, yeah. I watched the Country Roll English dub version of this and it wasn't as impactful because, again, it didn't have either of the sort of themes that went with it. And it was just yeah. like, oh, <clears throat> if you think you're hard, don't move. Final flash. Yeah, it was <laughs> certainly climactic. I was like, really? Oh. <laughs> All of a sudden, he turned, he turned British. If you think you're hard, mate. If you think you're hard, mate. Don't move, yeah? Yeah. Oh, it's just... Oh, it's dreadful. But yeah, um, this was a cool moment. I I, I enjoyed this. Final yeah. flash. And then... So, what's I actually this? think the um the one that he did to Jiren was, was more of something. Really? Yeah, yeah. I think I... I, I, think, I, 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 I think I preferred the final flash to Jiren. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I prefer. I prefer. Right. Like, I don't know. Look wise, I prefer it because obviously the animation's a lot better now and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. this one, I don't know. It was just the whole build up, like. It's stuff. true. It's true. Yeah. It's true. And, I just, I just find it uh, funny when he hit Jiren with it, and just suddenly Jiren's on the floor. Yeah. And then, then Vegeta's having his laugh because yeah, yeah, he's yeah. gloating. And then next thing you know, he's hit out of nowhere. It's like, wait a minute. Yeah, it's like, you were laughing. You were looking at the guy on the floor. So how did he fly kick you in the 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 the, the stomach? Cause he's that fast, baby. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then what's this? Yeah, like this. Yeah, both fine flashes, dope. Number yeah. four, Vegeta's sacrifice when he blows up to kill Boo and that. Like that's mm-hmm. another list. And then number three is Father Son coming me hard against Cell. And then number two is a whole new Gohan when he comes back as Mystic slash Ultimate Gohan against the Boo. Yeah, that was something. That yeah. was something. But you, you know how it is when when everyone gets power ups and they get too cocky. <laughs> yeah, they fail. He should have got. He should if he got the the he got the hot tag and if he got the finish, you know. Yeah, that'd have that. been better. <laughs> yeah, but no, he had a Cody Rhodes at WrestleMania thirty nine. Yeah. Moment, yeah. <laughs> He had him yeah. on the ropes and then he got too cocky and then there was no mm. solo. But yeah. <laughs> um, number one is Vegeta's Respect, where Goku is fighting Kid Buu again. Just after the bit where Go- Vegeta had to um, buy, pick, buy Goku time against Kid Buu. And yeah. then he's watching them fight and he's like, oh, Kakarot, he's something else you know he blah, 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 blah. yeah I know. Yeah. yeah i mean yeah i i, I would have i might have preferred the bit but the bit after he finished the boost again you know when they do the double thumbs up yeah yeah yeah, yeah. where she was on the floor i think and goku's standing up yeah and they're like yeah we bros we we yeah. are actually bros yeah we actually like um, each other yeah yeah it was always a one-sided thing i hated you, you, you yeah me. yeah yeah <laughs> but but you know to, to i don't Ah uh, yes, okay. I get that. That moment is like, yep, yeah, solidifying who's number one, and he, and Vegeta is kind of like a more better man for accepting it. Yeah. But I, I still think that the you know he kind of when he went to sacrifice himself with the final um, explosion. Yeah. Was more of it, and the, and then it's one of those things where you don't really need the dialogue because by the time he comes back and he gives the uh, when they finish the when they finish Boo and they double thumbs up, that's that you know. That's yeah. when the the respect is already yeah. stand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And like, it, I don't feel like Vegeta is the type of character who would admit it because no. he's so egotistical. That's yeah. that's the thing. Um, yeah, it's true. However, yeah. you know they do have to explain stuff for the sto- uh, for the stories. Yeah. So uh, I, I can see why they did it. It just yeah, seemed it seemed... Let, a bit out of character. Yeah. 
And then... Well, not, not a bit out of character, but just a bit... His ego wouldn't allow him really to do that. If It's like, I'll do it in secret. I won't let anyone know. Yeah, kind of like um, GT when Goku dies. <laughs> and he's like, yeah, hold on to that kid. And he's like, oh, okay, what? But then I found another list. I'll quickly run for it as well. The Because yep. um, this one actually includes some GT stuff. So that's pretty okay. different. Okay. So uh, With some super stuff, because super doesn't seem to be much in, uh, in it. Yeah, and it's got some super stuff as well. Great, great, so, great. All right. Um, ten is King Piccolo's death. We've spoken about that. Number yeah. nine is over nine thousand. Right. Eight is Goku Super Saiyan transformation. Yeah. Eight is so is, don't, is that low on this? Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. Seven is Father Son coming Miha. Okay. Six is Vegeta's <laughs> sacrifice. Number yeah. five. This is where it gets different. Is the Pataru fusion when goku and vegeta put on the pataru earrings and become the ghetto okay yeah okay. Like, okay that's a that's a new one no one's ever really spoken about that which is weird because that's yeah wait hold on wait wait are you talking about the movie version or no, are you talking about the, the one in super one in no the one in z the pataru fusion yeah when Pitara... the earring oh yeah yeah sorry yeah no i'm getting mixed up yep yep sorry yeah. yep and like, oh, yeah, yeah, I was gonna say, I was because they never. Uh, I think in canon they never did that fusion, but I'm talking about the other fusion with the the, the finger point. Yeah, they, fusion, yeah, um, the yeah, yeah, they yeah, did yeah. that. They did that in the Brody movie. Yeah, but uh, and the the non-canon movies, but the, you know, it yeah. wasn't officially canon. No, <coughs> until that point. Until that point, yeah, yeah which was random. And then um, number six is the spirit bomb to. The Kai well, the Kaishin planet <coughs> spirit bomb, so the spirit bomb that kills Boo. Yeah. Yeah, surprise. Yeah, yeah. Where where yeah. where uh where Mr. Satan is like, come on world, because the world doesn't know who this Jabroni Goku is, yeah, apparently. Right? Help, Even yeah. though he, he won one tournament, right? But Yeah, but that's like thirty years ago at that point. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. So I get that, I get that, because Mr. Sa- Mr. Satan was the uh Hercule was the guy who did the um, the job for everyone in the end. And yeah. he used his uh Fame and infamy yeah. to save the world. Yeah. So yeah, I'm surprised that this is, hasn't been on any other list. That's quite yeah. yeah. <clears throat> that's a pretty good moment. Like when Goku gets the full power back. And, yeah, I can do it. And then, um, <laughs> um, hopefully we come back in another life, Boo, as a different person. Yeah, I'd like to see that. We could fight and you know whatever, and I could be a dad to you. Yeah, I can leave my children because that's what I do. <laughs> yeah. I could be a dad to you rather than my own kids. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Awkward. Yeah. And number three, this is a very, this is an interesting one. Like, oh, that's, right. that's cool. Is the Super Saiyan 4 transformation. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I, wouldn't say num- I wouldn't say 4 is, is, is more significant than, than the first one. No. Well, I don't, and, I don't I, know. And I'd rank, I, I might, I'll probably rank Gohan Super Saiyan 2 above that as well. Like, hmm. Because... Maybe it's ranked higher because, like, I don't know, maybe some sort of weird hindsight thing, like, people didn't really appreciate it at the time, and now it's kind of come back around. Um, yeah. Or it was the first new transformation in a while, and it's kind yeah. of different from all the others, <clears throat> which is what I kind of get. And, like, may, like how we turned Super Saiyan 4, was it? Hmm, I can't remember was it actually cool or not. The Brutes Wave thing? No. Nah, um, well, is that Vegeta? That's Vegeta. Yeah. It was something to do with Pan and then him getting beaten by Mar- I was about to say Margin Baby. Um by Baby and then turns for Golden Ape and then figuring out that he can't be Golden Ape. I don't know, some weird thing and then he turned into <laughs> Super Saiyan yeah. 4. Which is pretty cool at the time. Yeah. I get like I think I might have spoken before. I've sort of come around to Super Saiyan 4. I kind of I think it's a, like, this is weird. Now I'm like, you know what? It was alright. It was pretty good. It's not a bad transformation. No. It's just not relevant now that uh, Super Saiyan God and Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan yeah, right. are also transformations. That's blue and red. Uh, yeah, and Ultra Instinct and that stuff. Yeah. yeah, and then technically Brody's Su- Super Saiyan Wrath version is kind of Super Saiyan 4, but not really. Yeah, that's what I was saying, like, that's what I was saying, like, they should either give 
Super Saiyan 4 transformations are Broly. Like, that's his, yeah. like, splinter off tr- transformation or whatever. Yeah. Or the Gohan. One the, one the two. You know. And really, they should have just called that Super Saiyan Beast, right? Yeah. Yeah. That would make more sense. Much more sense. And then number two. Two, 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 two in this list is <coughs> GT's ending, which I agree with that. I like GT's ending. The whole, you know... Goku Jr., even though he's, like... Oh, not just... that bit. No, not that bit. Oh. The bit where they beat... Um, Omega Shin wrong, and then oh, him flying okay. the dragon, and oh, right, right. you've seen him oh, in the future yeah. sort of bit flying off, and they show all like everything from Dragon Ball to that moment in Dragon Ball GT. Yeah, man, that. Oh. Cause oh, I, okay, I'm not gonna lie, I watch that every, every now and then. Like, oh, that's pretty. Nice. I, I thought you meant the uh, the ending of you know where um, the Goku Junior is fighting for Vegeta Junior, and then Pan sees Goku's ghost, and then Goku's walking in the crowd of the market where he is, and then. When he says, all right, bye, see you later. And you get the flashes of, you know, the entire Dragon Ball saga yeah. while um, while Dan Dan, Dan is playing. Dan, 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 Dan. Yeah. 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 Well, maybe that's, that was, that, one that's something I remember. Yeah. <laughs> that, 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 that's what I thought you were referring to. I think um, they're referring to that whole bit, like when he yeah. dies and then that bit. And Yeah. They, yeah. they're referring to a different ending when, than I was. <laughs> yeah. you, you, you were referring to one significant point in the ending. They were referring to <laughs> yeah, yeah, the whole yeah. thing. Which, yeah, okay. and, uh, have you seen um have you seen uh what? you must have seen it uh dragon ball pa- path to power yeah where it's got goku jr at rubbish no 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 not that one. Oh, which one? Oh no am i mixing up the titles um the one where they did the uh, goku's origin story oh yeah yeah, in, yeah, yeah, in, yeah, yeah, yeah in yeah. 90s animation yeah yeah, uh, yeah. 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 like during gt and then they played the dan dan thing magic song at the at the end yeah i saw that I've seen yeah. it like a couple of times, but the first time I saw it, I downloaded it. This is back in like, say, 2003. No, I mean 2002. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And for some reason, how I downloaded it, I can only watch it in black and white. So I was like, right. it's amazing, but I can't see yeah. it in the color. <laughs> like, he does the comment me half for the first time. Yeah. That's animated like awesomely, but it was in black and white. So I was like, this is weird. <laughs> Dope. But yeah, that was cool. I might see if I can watch that again. And then. <laughs> Number one on this list is Mastered Ultra Instinct. So basically, the whole last bit of Dragon Ball Super, the yeah. Bit. yeah, which is uh, kind uh, of cool, uh, I guess. Uh, uh, I mean, I I will say personally, I might rank the end of the t- the Tournament of Power before uh before this, yeah, same like same where same they same. where Vegeta and Goku are teaming up against Jiren and. He can only power up to Super Saiyan one at that yeah. point, and then you know it's by the end of the entire thing, and they you know and then seventeen ekes out with the victory. Yeah, which was dope. Which I never saw comes like, ah, oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh. yeah, a bit a bit left field, but at the same yeah. time, it's like you know, it, it kind of makes sense not to be go with the predictable people. Yeah. Yeah, because that'd be like, oh yeah, Goku wins again. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, well, not necessarily Goku, but like but... And someone. T- Team Z related, you know? Yeah, because the person who, like, who won technically wasn't... He didn't want the same wish as them, really, did he? He's like, no, I, you know, I just want a wish for a million dollars, whatever, and a boat for my family so we can travel the world. Yeah. Not what yeah. you like, want to do, which is whatever. Yeah, and then yeah. he ends like, yeah, you know what? Revive all the universes that got deleted. And I was like, oh, yeah, that's yeah. quite nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, because if he didn't, <laughs> his universe would have got deleted. Yeah, so it's like, oh, okay. But, yeah. yeah, and I might watch Super again. Because apparently, if you've got Crunchyroll, anyone's listened to this, they have the English dub on it now, which is... Yeah. Okay. You know, I had to watch the English dub of Dragon Ball Super on um, BBC iPlayer. Oh, really? Yeah, it's on there. But, like... Oh, I didn't know that. It's kind of... It's edited quite a lot, obviously, because it's for, like, the kids' bits. But, it, yeah, it's pretty good. When you say edited, you mean, like... Um... Uh, you get cuts before the impact shots. Yeah, certain impact shots or like decapitations or like stabbings or anything like that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. But it's, it's, it is what it is. Do they do the thing where they just zoom up on the people's faces, or do yeah, they just straight or... cut it? Some it depends. Sometimes it's on people's faces. Sometimes it's straight cut. Yeah, and sometimes it's just you see the reactions. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But yeah, it was worth a watch. You know. Well, how how's that gonna work with the the, the scythe that um. That Goku Black has. Yeah. <laughs> and the sword that Trunks has that uses to cut Goku, uh, Zamatsu, fuse the Masu in half. <laughs> I 
if I remember correctly, they kind of get around that because you know he's all like gooey and stuff. So technically, yeah. not human, whatever. So you kind of get around that. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. Oh, so, like, if, you, if anyone's bored, you can do that watch. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> but yeah. Um. So they basically covered like most of the stuff I enjoyed about. So. Yeah. What about you? Yeah. Some some surprises in there. Some moments that I thought were going to be in there that weren't. That weren't. Yeah. What kind of moments yeah. are you thinking about like that? You think? Oh, I, think I mentioned though when 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 Brody goes Super Saiyan. Yeah. Uh, the Super version, anyways. Yeah, right? yeah, not the original stupid. Um, I hate you because you cry as a baby version of. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go go ahead. Super Saiyan two wasn't even in there. No. Uh, any of the lists, I don't think. No. It wasn't. Um. Yeah. Um. The, yeah, that's annoying. Yeah, Goku, uh, Goku, uh, Vegeta. Which uh Gogeta and Brody find that breaks time. Yeah, in space. Yeah, that was an area. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Weird. Yeah. yeah. Um. Like. Yeah. Um. It, it's a, not necessarily strange list, but it's just like oh, these some some moments I expect to be in there are in there, and there's some moments where you're like, oh, this is this is Guaranteed awesome. Guaranteed to be in there, but it's not. Yeah, yeah exactly. Because uh, I would have put um, I obviously go on Super Saiyan two, like you said. I would yeah, yeah. have put that in my version. Um, yeah. Even Vegeta turned to Super Saiyan for the first time. Well, he's. Him retelling his ver- him becoming Super Saiyan, I would have put that in there as well. Yeah, like, yeah, it shows him got to the point like if I it has to be pure, this, yeah, and I'm, I'm pure evil. Yeah, <laughs> like, you know, if I can't survive this, what's the point of living? And then you know, boom, then he became Super Saiyan on a, on a, on yeah. a asteroid. Yeah. yeah, 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 <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 asteroid, um, rain raining down behind him on this yeah. random planet that he was fighting, yeah, yeah, how he got there, oh. but yeah, <laughs> this... um, yeah. And, but you're not, you're not counting the movies, right? I, no. I would even say when they, when uh, Goku and Vegeta finally defeat Metacooler, yeah, that's uh, yeah, 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 and then there's a whole army of them, and they're like, yeah, like. Oh. <sighs> Or I'll even yeah. count if we're counting like those movies that are not canon and whatever. You know the uh, the last one of Dragon Ball Z. Um, I can't. Where they fight Janemba? No, no, no. The one after that. Um, okay. I can't remember the English name for it, but it's called um, uh, the world is in trouble. Who can help this super awesome guy? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, and it's the one where um, is it Pil? Not Pilaf. Tur. Ah. Uh, the guy who it depends on what canon it is gave Trunks his sword. Um, oh, him, yeah, 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 super... yeah. Oh, I can't remember. I forgot his name. Yeah, um, when... Goku... Zenkai! Zenkai boost! Yeah, there you go. No, 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 I mean the boost, but you know when the Saiyans depower, uh, get power from there? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it took us, what, <laughs> uh, over an hour over to an get hour, to that. Yeah. <laughs> um... But the, the final battle where he's fighting is that monster thing again. I've got that yeah. monster thing's name is, and Goku does the um, dragon punch yeah. when he like not the sure you can dragon punch though. No, it's the literal where he punches someone and turns into a dragon. Yeah, <laughs> when he does that, and it looks awesome. Like I would add me personally, I would that would be on my list. Um, I'm trying to think what else and. A moment from the, I don't know. A lot of people don't oh, like this movie, yeah. but I'd like it. Um, I forgot. Yeah, I know I mentioned it before, but you know, I'm surprised it's not on any of those lists. When uh, Trunks went Super Saiyan Okari, so yeah. Yeah, yeah. Super Saiyan, like yeah. Super Saiyan Blue and Kaioken together. My I, I, I like versus Hit as well. I, I never mentioned that, but that's also none. Of, three lists and none of them are on it. Yeah. Um, but the one I would. Oh. Yeah, there's a there's a move there's a Dragon Ball movie that not many people like. I kind of get it, but I like it for some weird reason. Wait, wait, the, you mean evolution? No, no, no. Oh, no, no, don't be silly. Um, <laughs> uh, um, Bio Broly. Oh, yeah, okay, I remember yeah. that one. Not many people like that one. Yeah, but I like it just because it kind of spotlights Goten and Trunks. Yes, yes. and then at the it's... end, where they do a Double no, dude, triple call me on the Him, Goku, no, sorry, go hot, go ten trunks and Krillin do I can't a double a triple call me on the to to finally defeat itself. Not so yeah. Broly, 
fire burning. Yeah. yeah, at least they give someone else the uh, the glory, right? Yeah, and it's wait, it's the oh, it's the Broly Returns movie where go when um Krillin shows up to try to do the Piccolo thing, which happens in every movie, and it's not actually Piccolo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But yeah, so um, that's what I'll probably add to my list. Mm. Yeah, so um, oh no, and the best moment that no everyone no, I'm surprised none of the list have this moment because it's epic. Yeah, yeah. When Yamcha gets killed by the Cyberman, <laughs> 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 why yeah. isn't that on any of these lists? Because that is hilarious. Why? <laughs> oh, definitely, what it is is definitely memorable. <laughs> oh, that's like a meme. That's like yeah. Everyone yeah. sort of took taken the mick out of in every sort of thing. There's I saw something the other day with lots of animes that have copied it. <laughs> it's just yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, that's funny. People forgot about that. Oh. Yeah, he, that's the Yamcha is like the joke. Uh, yeah. Of, yeah. Oh. Yamcha. Um. So yeah. Um. Thank you, Toriyama, for all the memories. Yeah. I have to say. Yep. Yeah. Be missed, my dude. Like literally, he's been like. Behind the the, the the like the curtain bit of us recording, like it's been it's come to a week of him being dead at this point, mm. and yeah. yeah, I still like every day. I'm like, oh man, he's, he's dead. I, I just wonder how. Okay, so how much did he plan in advance? But then he seems to be the type of writer who doesn't really yeah, do that. No, yeah. <laughs> um. So, but how many plot points going forward is is still left that um. He planned, yeah. And ha- and at what point is he just going to be pure Toyotaro or yeah. Toei Animation coming up with stuff? Yeah, like it basically did for like GT in it because I think he like oh, yeah. GT didn't he just like write the first couple of episodes and then they done the rest didn't it? And he just like had well, I think he had some involvement and yeah. then it just seemed completely it, it, it was quite different though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so GT Goku time, right? Yeah. Goku time, yeah. Yeah, so uh, I guess that's yeah. Um, thank you. Um, yes, um, I will be watching the Dragon Ball Dama. Daima. Dai Daima. Yeah, when that comes out at some point this year. Yeah. 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 And yeah, um, and I'll try and keep up with because I don't read the anime. I'm not sorry, I don't read the manga, but I get told what happens in it, so I'll try and keep. Up. Yeah. Do you do you watch Dragon Ball Heroes? No. Um, no, no. Is it Dragon Ball Hero? It is Dragon Ball Hero, yeah, right? That weird one. That yeah, yeah. Awesome things happen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like that's that, that's non-canon, there. but yeah. also, you know. I might actually give that a watch now. I'm surprised yeah. they like dubbed it. Mm. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Where there's a there's some other scenes that come out of nowhere. So yeah. Yeah. You're like, oh, okay. That, but the it's weird because they got they they got two Goku. They got Goku Super Saiyan Four Goku and. Um, Goku, isn't it? Well, Ultra, yeah, 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 yeah. They got the time traveler Goku and time yeah. traveler. But okay, okay, you yeah. know, all right. Like the things you I know? see, are like this is insane, and I, 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 I don't know where I ha- well, I, where to jump on because this seems. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's, it's locked out. It's yeah. a continuity lockout, right? Yeah. Because like, it's know. like, is the games involved exactly? What's what? You know. But apparently, I think the I think the Xenoverse game somehow involved in it as well. So I'm saying this, it's weird. Yeah. yeah. Do you have to play the games to know what's going on with the thing? You know. Yeah. It's like I, I don't know where to start. Where to begin? Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. So, um, thank you. And guys, if uh, let us know your favorite like um, Toriyama moments and Dragon Ball moments, or if did you watch any of his other stuff like Dragon Quest? You play the games of that and Blue Chrono, Dragon. Chrono, no, I haven't. I haven't played Dragon Quest though. Yeah. I did play Chrono Trigger. Oh yeah, that's him as well, wasn't it? Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, him. No, I think he just did the designs for it, maybe. Yeah, and I think he did design. Yeah, yeah, I think he might be right. And I think there's a game called Blue Dragon or something like that. He had something to do with it as well. I can't remember. Mm. So, yeah, let us know that you could do that. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, leave a comment in the comment section. If you're listening to this in the audio realms, you can go to one of our social media platforms and um, leave us a message there. So, that's like Twitter, Instagram. You can send us an email. Um, <coughs> And if, if you are watching this YouTube, don't forget to like and subscribe. It'd be cool. Yeah, you know. And <clears throat> I have been the guy who once had purple hair and then had green hair because I forgot about continuity. Carl Charles and... Hey.
But actually, no, I, I think, so, purple then blue. Sorry, blue. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not green. No, like yeah, <laughs> that's Beaumont. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, yeah, yeah. That that the hair color. I guess. Yeah. Whatever. Right. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. I suppose. You know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, you write for 40 years you kind of forget what I'm ahead of half my yeah, yes. sure, you know oh. Trump's not understand the Bowman one's like but she, you, you've always written her that's <laughs> do you forget the colour of her hair but sure whatever yeah and I I, I have um, I was the enemies for a certain so, uh, the old man and the fat man <laughs> who then was changed to the two te- teenage kids who would then also change to the Weird mutated time traveling yeah. bug monster. See why Chong. <laughs> Did you hear the story behind um Android sixteen and seven? Oh, sorry, yeah, Android nineteen and twenty. So they were originally sixteen and seventeen, right? But then yeah. they had to Toriyama's editor. They said, "What? Yeah. what? So these are going to be the villains of Target." So then he changed it, even though we already called them sixteen and se- uh, seventeen. So yeah. they changed it to eighteen and nineteen. Uh, um, and I heard something about like people said they weren't scary, so he changed it to teenagers. And someone else was like, "So you went from like creepy old men to young teenagers?" Yeah. What? So then that's why you added um, robot hand one. What's his face? So no um. Ah, oh, he's sixteen, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's why you added him as well. <laughs> it's like so you just had like a mismatch yeah. of like things uh, uh, that you thought were scary and no one else thought was scary. So then you've uh, oh. and then uh, I'm sure you know the original reason why uh, Toriyama decided to make uh, uh, Super Saiyan no. uh, with with uh, non-coloured hair. <laughs> no. Oh, uh, because you know his assistants are gonna colour all the black in. Uh, okay. Yeah. So he's like, nah, nah, let's just make these things go a bit smoother. If yeah. he's got white, like in in the in the manga, it's black and white. So then, yeah. they, if it's blonde, they need to color the hair in, you know. Yeah. Uh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Huh. And yeah, and if you have any interesting Dragon Ball facts of your own, let us know. And until next time, guys, thank you for taking a trip with us around the multiverse. And once again, thank you, Akira Toriyama. Bye. 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 Thank you.